El PAC Scientific es de navegación. Europark is an initiative of the University of Valencia Science Park. Well, you know, from a young age, I always loved the biological sciences. I always loved how things worked, biological organisms and so on. Insects, butterflies, creepy crawlies, all that kind of stuff. So I think it was only natural that I dedicated my investigation and my studies to the biological sciences. So with this interest in creepy crawlies and bugs and biological organisms, I think it was only natural that when it came to the point of formalizing my studies, that I went to study the biological sciences, and I did that studying biochemistry at, at Heriot Watt University in Edinburgh. Um, I had some great times in Edinburgh, I learned a lot of stuff, and at the end of those studies, there started to begin this, this, new tendence, this new tendency, this new area of study, which was the genetic sciences, the genetic sciences. And so uh, I managed to gain a European-sponsored uh, scholarship to study the, uh, uh, my first master's in the molecular genetics area applied to human pathologies. So I spent 20 years now in Spain uh, since 2003 and in that time I've been working for a number of companies both international and Spanish companies like um, Biomarin and Biogen. I've also worked in the rare disease field with companies like Orphan Europe which is now called Ricordati and in companies of medical device development companies like Bygone which is, which is an international company based in France. So I've arrived now in EpiDisease. I uh, started working with EpiDisease Two years ago, I, as a consultant, I formally entered into the EpiDisease team one year ago, January this year. And at EpiDisease, I handle all things commercial. So that's both the sales side, the marketing side, communication, and investor relationships, where I am involved in talking to entities and persons that are interested in helping us develop these new tools that are really going to impact the lives of these patients that we're trying to help. We're very lucky in EpiDisease to have been uh, involved in the European Innovation Council program and project. I'm currently undergoing a university, uh, the European EIC program for business validation, which we uh, finished today, in fact. Um, so very, very helpful and very thankful for the European Innovation Council for those things. And additionally, because we went through that process, we received their seal of excellence for a project that we're developing here called HisShock for sepsis. And thanks to that seal of excellence, we now received a, a large tranche of funding from the Spanish government, thanks to that seal of excellence. So that's an international project, a European-based project, so both hospitals here in Spain and in Europe, in Denmark and Italy. So working in the park obviously offers us a, a, a huge amount of benefits working in the park, working with a, a group of companies, excellent companies, pioneers in their own different uh, areas of, of, of pioneering work, and, and that breeds excellence. Excellence breeds excellence. So we're very fortunate to be within this cohort, this pedigree of people and groups over here. Obviously being in the same place also breaks down those barriers to communication. We can very freely communicate to these people. Um, you know the challenges that, uh, that we're faced are the challenges that all companies face in our, in, our, in our product lifeline which is the financing but just having the logo of the park on our presentations definitely opens doors to talk to those people that hold the purse strings that allow us to get further financing for the future.